On September 2nd, 1993, Andre Risen was charged with assaulting Lisa at a Kroger supermarket. The charges were later dropped. And then on September 15th, 1993, less than two weeks later, Lisa was arrested for fighting with police at the Georgia Dome Stadium. She was fined 200 bucks and ordered to do community service and then enter an alcohol treatment program. Damn. They're just drunkenly going at each other all the time anywhere. Yeah, this is not uh, going to end well. All right, that brings us to the first fire. Oh, one of many fires. Okay. After one fight, Lisa threw a bunch of teddy bears that she had bought for Andre into his bathtub. Well, their bathtub. Yeah. Yeah. And lit them on fire. I remember this happening. It was like a big (laughs) Kurt Loder breaking news of this happening. Not yet. Yeah. This fire was successfully contained. Self-contained. By them? In the bathtub. Because the bathtub was made of marble. Oh, so okay. just the teddy bears suffered in this incident. Oh, I thought I thought that was it for for the one that everyone knew about, but maybe not. Okay, well, that brings us to the second fire. Fire, fire number two. <laughs> On June 9th, fire in the hole. <laughs> 1994, Lisa was sick and tired of all of Andre's playing around. So she decided to have a girl's night out, and she was going to come home really late to make him jealous. Yeah. So she got back with her entourage at 5 a.m. Damn. But then, as luck would have it, Andre's car was not in the driveway. <laughs> And he ended up coming home shortly after she did. That's such a power move. Yeah. (laughs) I couldn't have been planned better for him. Or worse, depending on (laughs) your perspective. It's like the person that tries to go really late to the party because they're cool, but then someone else comes after them. (laughs) And so then when he got out of the car, they shared dirty looks. And Lisa gave him one of those looks like, oof. You're about to get it. She gave the yeah. left eye. Yeah. And they, you know, the usual, they're like hitting each other. They take it into the house. They started screaming and fighting in the bedroom. He pinned her down to stop her. Then he would go and ball up in the corner and let her hit him. And a guy like that, he's like a big football player. He can't go full force and, like, no. you know, have a real fight. It's like, it's a very volatile situation. Lisa is on record saying he never full out punched her. Good. You know, I'm not excusing his actions, yeah. but for what it's worth. So Lisa eventually passes out. And then when she wakes up, she looks at herself in the mirror and notices a huge bruise on her lips. And now she's more enraged than ever. So she goes to his closet. She sees all these new tennis shoes of his, none of them in her size. Like, why didn't he buy me a pair of these? <laughs> So then these shoes I don't need right now. Yeah, they're all stacked up. So then she took them to the new fiberglass bathtub. Okay. That replaced the other one and grabs lighter fluid and starts a fire with the intention of destroying his shoes only. <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. And we have a clip. I came and it was like, boom. Oh, wow. You know, the exorcist. <laughs> that was Andre Risen. <laughs> yeah, Man, I hear it. Like, just throwing him in there. Just like, Lisa left eye here? Yep. You're gonna burn. She's crazy, man. And sexy and cool. When Andre yeah. got the tub replaced, Lisa assumed it was replaced with marble. This is Raindrop. But it wasn't. The sister. Flames are growing. The fire, the intense, everything is just getting bigger. We all stopped what we was doing and we looked up. This black smoke just rolling, just rolling. Instead of, you know, the flames getting smaller, literally they just like went up to the ceiling. Mm -hmm. Then I'm just like looking at her, looking at the flames, looking (laughs) at her, looking at the flames. Looking at her, looking at the flames. And at that point, I'm just like, okay, we got to go. I like how this girl is so passive. Like, uh, the flames are coming at her. She's like, what are we going to do here? <laughs> yeah, run out of the house. What are you talking about? <laughs> That's the sister, remember? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Firefighters arrived at 6.49 a.m. By this point, Lisa has fled the scene. And she surrendered to police the next day. 
So this made headlines. Yeah, it was huge. Huge news. This is the one where Kurt Loder. Yeah, broke breaking in, news. Yeah, he broke into like a Bush, you know, music video, <laughs> yeah. Machine Head or something. Sorry to interrupt Beavis and Butthead. Kurt Loder, yeah, but here. we have breaking yeah. news. I'm gonna I'm gonna bring it to bring in Tab of the Soren here. Yeah. We're gonna talk about Lisa Left Eye burning Andre Risen's house down, and then we're gonna go back to you know more bush after yeah. this. <laughs> <laughs> the media made Lisa out to be crazy and that Andre was the victim because it was being reported that she was seen just hitting him outside. But her side is that she was the victim. Yeah. News organizations had fun with the whole TLC name. They would say things like, what she is accused of doing yesterday is far from tender love and care. <laughs> that, that sucks. Like, yeah. <laughs> they all had their puns ready yeah. for yeah. this story. They yeah. all have a big smirk. Just and that's, yeah. satisfied. One of, that's one of many that <laughs> reporting on this story. I'm talking newspapers, TV. God. Well, they get like 22 year old college grads writing this copy, this bullshit that yeah. they're going to say. So, you know, I'm not surprised it's that hack. Right. Andre told the press the next day that he still loved her and he even bailed her out of jail. What was the bail? I wonder if it was like a million bucks. No, it was higher, but reduced to 75,000. Okay. Mm. Yeah, it's his, you know, it's contained mm -hmm. into their property. Fortunately, it didn't go over and like burn the neighbor's right. house down and catch, you know, they're far enough houses away that it didn't do that. It did burn to the ground, though. Oh, my God. And the judge was not sympathetic because of the point you just brought up. Yeah. For the very fact that, yes, people could have been hurt. But if it was drier, if there was some wind catching, you know, it could have got oh, yeah. into, like, the woods or something. Horrible. The judge sentenced Lisa to five years probation and three months at a diversion center, as well as a $10,000 fine. The relationship between Andre and Lisa would continue on and off for seven years, ending in 2001. And now that brings us back to TLC. In November 1994, their second album, Crazy Sexy Cool, is released. The big one. And it sold 11 million copies. Whoa. Lisa believed that the fire incident helped generate heat Hello. for the new album. Nice. Oh, that absolutely yeah, did. The, yeah. The group appeared on the cover of Vibe magazine in fireman gear. Nice. Oh, that's hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely helped. Wow. Th that PR team is like, let's push the fire into yeah. this. 